In February, the Pan American Health Organization donated defibrillators to the Ministry of Health, Wellness, and Elderly Affairs. The health organization continues its commitment to the improvement of the health sector in St. Lucia and around the region. Power Country Program Specialist Reynold Hewitt anticipates the defibrillators will directly assist patients in need of cardiac rehabilitation. The Pan American Health Organization is pleased to hand over these 10 defibrillators to the Ministry of Health where they can be used to aid in resuscitation of persons who may have suffered um, cardiac arrest or arrhythmia or irregular heartbeat. We are certain that these will be put to good use in the ministry to help persons to ensure that the quality of health care provided to the population is of such that they will, and that they will maintain um, adequate health, their heartbeat will function as it ought to normally. Permanent Secretary Jenny Daniel says the Ministry of Health recognizes the importance of partnership in continuous efforts to improve the island's health services. We know, of course, the significance of NCDs or non-communicable diseases um, to our population, it affecting the health of our po population. And so today we are here with our partners, PAHO, um, receiving 10 defibrillators, which have been very kindly donated to the health system in St. Lucia. We commit at the ministry to ensure that those pieces of equipment are utilized in the most effective and efficient manner and to ensure that the persons who need it the, the most have access to it. The Ministry of Health thanked PAO for their continued support and encouraged continued partnerships with other sectors as the country works towards better health care. For the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, I'm Sant Justin.